Now on the tee is the 10:22 tee time. First up, representing Florida State University by way of the Commonwealth of Kentucky, Lydia Gum. Before coming to Florida, senior golfer Lydia Gum made history on the bluegrass of Kentucky. From qualifying for the high school state championship in the third grade, making tournament history as the youngest player ever to make the cut, to getting inducted into her high school hall of fame with her dad, Lydia's drive to success started at a young age. We've got a lot of athletes on both sides of the family. We've always put a lot of importance on, on sports, and because sports is so good. And it, one thing about it, when our kids are at a ball field or at a golf course, we never have to worry about them because they're always around good people. And, and we've always believed that That's true. and kind of lived by that. Moving away from home is never an easy transition. Lydia's decision to attend FSU over schools such as Louisville and Ole Miss left her 10 hours away from home. But with an impressive collection of achievements, including finishing fourth in the Kentucky Open and holding the Kentucky high school record for most rounds counted in the 60s, having multiple offers came as no surprise. She was recruited heavily and, and couldn't blame her at all for coming down here. The facilities are sweet, great coaching staff. And, uh, you know, I wasn't too upset for her because I knew she was going to a really good, you know, really good program. Overcoming difficulties is part of the game. Although enduring multiple surgeries, Lydia always found a way to stay on course and come out on top. As a sophomore, Lydia was selected as team captain by her fellow teammates. If you really focus on getting better each day, um, you really see the results. And that's something I've tried to do and just work as hard as I can. And uh, to see it pay off is really exciting. On course team chemistry is vital in athletics. The ability and performance of each individual player often depends on the consistency and camaraderie of their teammates. Basically what she does is she has so much compassion for her teammates that she makes everybody feel welcome. Regardless of whether she's known them for 20 minutes or five years, she always makes everybody feel very comfortable and always engages them in their conversations and makes everybody really feel a part of our family. Just the team chemistry is awesome. It's like one big family, and that's something I'll never forget, for sure. We're very proud of her, and, but more so than that, I think she's probably a better person than she is a golfer, and we've been a lot more proud than that. Gum's 2016 fall season was her career best with a career low average of 72.42 in 12 rounds. Her strong play and determination helped lead the Seminoles to three championships in four tournaments. Lydia is a very hard worker, so in that way she's pushed me to uh, work harder as well, and I'm very grateful for that. And I mean, we play a lot together almost every day, so her great personality, her sunny personality has been a very great influence to me. Lydia as a player has begged me in a way positively because she would motivate me to, oh, why don't we go and practice? Why don't we go and play nine holes on the weekend? And it's someone that it's so good to be around because you know it's, she's always positive, smiling. So my past four years here, I've gone so fast just because I've been enjoying my time around her. Lydia Gum's true self is shown off the course through expressions of compassion. Her close relationship with her family and friends show that this athlete's drive is about much more than a girl and her clubs. Her caring and compassion rubs off on everybody. So you never know, in the coming years, we may have the Lydia Gum Award for somebody with the biggest heart because there's not a day that goes by that she's not thinking about somebody else. An impeccable athlete and a caring individual, Lydia Gum is truly a hole in one. I'm Asahi Hirano for Seminole Sports Magazine.